हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू आर न्यू वीडियो आई एम डॉक्टर फराहत अली एंड इन दिस वीडियो वी विल लर्न दैट हाउ वी कैन एंटर डाटा इन स्टाटा एटीन सॉफ्टवेयर सो विदाउट वेस्टिंग एनी टाइम लेट स्टार्ट इफ यू आर न्यू टू अवर चैनल प्लीज डू नॉट फॉर गेट टू सब्सक्राइब द चैनल देर आर थ्री वेज टू एंटर द डाटा इन स्टाटा सॉफ्टवेयर वन ऑफ दैम इज टू इम्पोर्ट द फाइल एंड द सेकेंड मैथड इज टू यूज द डिफरेंट कमांड्स like generate id and the third method is to use the data editor option i'm going to use all of these option in this video so let's start with the first method which is so simple you just have to go to file and here you will find out import option and uh, currently i have the data file in sav format which is spss data and uh, i'm going to click on this option it will ask me to give me the file address i'm going to click on the browse option and here i can see survey original data file and uh, i have just to simply click on the okay button and here i can click on okay and all of the variables 137 variables with 439 observation like these are the data and these are the variables all data has been imported in the data 18 software now if we want to see the data i can click on this option data editor and uh, when i will click on this option i can see all of my data here these are the respondents like 439 were the respondent and you as you can see and if you scroll the file at right side you will see that these are the variables like here you can see the different variables and if you want to change anything in the data file like if you want to change the label you can see here these are the variables name here and uh, you can change the variables label like if you want to change the variable label for optimism from strongly agree to disagree and uh, you can change them in going to the variable manager option so in variable manager option i will click on optimism here i can see value label if i already created a value label i can select the label from the list but currently i haven't any label for this variable so i am going to click on the manage option in manage i can create a new label and i'm going to create a likert scale and here i can mention value 1 as strongly disagree add 2 for disagree 3 for neutral 4 for agree and 5 for strongly agree so i have created this label and label name is here i can click on the close button now from the value value label option i can select likert scale and i have to click on the apply option and if you want to change for other you can select likert scale for all of these and uh, this is the way that you can change the variable values a label option from variable manager so let's move to the sec second option if you want to create a new variable in your data file or if you want to start creating manually different datas different variables in your data set and uh, here i am going to create a new file where i can guide you that you how you can create data entry manually so there is a new file here i am going to create id gender and education variable how ca i can create it you can write generate or you can simply write gen and you have to give the space id equal sign and then period you have to click on the enter button so id variable has been created 
now i'm going to create gender variable so gen gender equal sign period enter next i'm going to create a variable of trust so gen space you can write generate or gen trust equal sign and enter the full stop next education gen space education one thing that you have to make sure you cannot enter the space here like if i am going to create political communication i cannot give the space here like if i am going to click this the give the space it's asking me giving me error too many variables specified so gen political you can use underscore and here i have created so if you want to give the label of these variable you can go to variable manager here you can find out the id gender trust education political communication you can uh, create manage option you can use create labels here you can give the values to your variables now if you want to go and if you want to create change the name of your variable you can change here if you want to label it you can use these option to give the label of your variable and uh, now, now let's move to the third option if you want to create the data file using the data editor option so i am going to create a new data file okay so here you can go to the variable data editor option of stata and here you will see a blank space file and uh, you can create as many variable as per your need like if i want to create male female option you can write 1 1 1 2 2 2 2 2, two option and if for education master mphil and phd master mphil phd 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 and then you can create other variables option as well so you can create as many variable as you need and then you can change the labels here if you want to create change the label of these variables you can simply go to the editor option and here data editor variable manager option i'm going to close this option okay so right now i have created different files so we have a new file here okay let's create a new file i am going to close the previous one so here we can use the data editor option and uh, i can write 121212 and uh, later on i can give the name to these variables like i have created these one and if you go to the variable manager option here you can see variable one variable two variable one is id or you can gen name it as a gender and uh, you can give the values from the manager option okay so one or more variable properties have been modified to prevent losing these changes like okay create label and uh, here i can write one and you can specify one with the male and two with the female so i have applied these variable name must be filled like it's gender or you can write label one label two and here i have labeled it as gender now if i go to the data editor file you will see male female male female option one to two and these are the th three options to create or to enter data in data 18 software first to import the file second using commands generate or gen and third one is using the data editor option and you can modify those from variable manager so i hope you have liked this video please do not forget to subscribe the channel share the video thank you for watching bye